Hello, this is Crystal, and I'm here with a 99 cent store haul, a Ross haul, mini haul, and a Bath and Body Works haul, and a Hello Kitty Amazon haul. Um, I'm going to start off with 99 cent store. Um, everyone has been hauling these. These are the Cheez It sandwich crackers, Italian four cheese, a six pack. I just did pick up one because I'm not too sure how my boyfriend is going to like these. But I did like the expiration date of October 12, 2017. So, got one of those. And then I saw uh, Diva Dollar, I think her name is. is she hauled these limited uh, batch fudge stripe cookies with peppermint. And um, I did get these because we are going to an event on Saturday. And I'm going to be making a homemade dessert, so I might just bring these and put them on a cute plate from the 99 cent store, because we're not that big on peppermint here. But this is always good to keep in. Um, there's some things I like to keep to take to potlucks that are just really simple and easy, and this is an example. But I am bringing something homemade, too. Um, the expiration date on this is August um, 6, 2017. And again, I just picked up one. Um, I love snack wells. Um, I've loved them ever since I was a little kid. So this is chocolate mint devil's food cookies cake. And these are a fat free snack. Um, it says new. I'm not sure how new they are. And the expiration date on this is September 11th, 2017. Um, again, I just noticed it was mint. So actually, these two cookies might be sitting on a cute platter for Saturday for that potluck. Um, I was happy to find Back to Nature gluten-free double chocolate cherry brownie cookies. Um, Back to Nature is a great brand. So um, I did pick up just one box because I've never tried out their black cherry fudge cookies. Um, expiration date is September 9th, 2017. So again, you can see I got like a lot of snacky type of stuff. And the real reason why I went there is because I was starting to run out of these so clear mineral waters, which I just am loving. I'm seriously drinking four a day. Um, orange seems to be my favorite right now and all they had I picked up I believe the last two orange and I think I left one more of the lime lime is okay but I just grabbed it because I was kind of desperate so anyways these are really super good grabbed four packs and then I just thought this was just too too cute and I don't know if this company is going out of business or what is going on but this company was actually sold at I believe Walmart and Target and I don't know if they're changing their look or what's going on I don't really care all I know is it's at the 99 cent store and it I had to pick up one of each now this says save water shower with me it says deep cleansing shower gel the only thing it didn't do was give me an idea of what it smells like and I didn't want to open it up um, it does say sparkle like a ray of human sunshine. And then this says um, bath gift set. So I'm not sure if they broke apart these gift sets or what happened. But anyways, you can see the cute, pretty, sparkly pink lips. It's 500 milliliters or 16.9 fluid ounces. And let's see, it is called Beauteous. And then I did pick up the other one, which is in a really cute um, Tiffany teal color. So of course I had to get the pink on pink and the Tiffany teal. And these were the um, the two types of um, bottles that they had. They also had, um, again, I think it was Dollar Diva who showed it. There's some type of, they had like a three pack for 99 cents, but there were little tubes. And I just really didn't feel like I needed that, especially since I have so much bath and body. But um, I could not resist these for 99 cents, these um, shower gels. And trust me, I don't need shower gels. I have a lot from bath and body, but just too cute. I knew they would be gone. Um, Lorelei 17 and has um, hauled these and 
Um, I had to get it because this is Crest mouthwash and I use mouthwash at least two or three times a day so when I saw that it was Crest mouthwash I went to my local store and sure enough they did have it so I did pick up um, two of them they're 500 milliliters each and I'm not sure what the expiration date is the expiration date is um, June 2018 so again that's an awesome expiration date and there seems to be some type of pump in here so I'm not sure if I pump this out or how this works as you can tell there's like a tube going down and honestly right now thinking about it I really should have picked up more than two because you can't go wrong with Crest mouthwash for 99 cents each and then I know Lorelai has been hauling these like crazy, but I just wanted to give it a try. But this it really is a good deal. And this is the Sensodyne Pro Namel. It is It does say 6 to 12, but I'm kind of with her. I will use it anyways. And um, they actually didn't have this for a while. And yesterday when I went, they finally had them. So I'm going to try it out today. It is a tube, and it is... Let me see, it is four ounces. So just sits like that. And I have really been liking the Crest Brilliant Boost. So I did buy another one, Crest 3D White. Um, it really does help. I drink so much coffee and iced tea that I really do need something like this. And I've noticed the difference. This is three ounces. And like I said, I did buy, no, I'm sorry, I just bought one Pro Enamel. I picked up another one of these. My boyfriend likes this extra whitening crest. He likes this tube. So he picked that up for himself. And then today is my cleaning day, which is Monday. I clean my restroom. So I needed rust, lime, and calcium for my shower. This does an excellent job, just um, FYI. And then I needed some bleach because I bleached down my bathroom today. Um, that is what I picked up at the 99 cent store. Oh, wait, I have one more item. Okay, my boyfriend actually picked this up, which I was surprised because he always complains about how much cereal we have. But he found um, a General Mills Spring Edition Reese's Puff Bunnies, and it's 13 ounces. I know some of you guys have already hauled these. Um, but the expiration date is awesome. Um, February 11th, 2018. I kind of wish I would have been at the 99 cent store where he found these because I'm sure there was a lot of awesome cereal. But he was really sweet to bring me one. So, can't complain. Okay. So now my little Ross haul. Um, these are super cute shoes. These are, let me see, they're not a name brand. They just say not rated. Um, these are a size nine, which is really weird because I'm usually a size eight or an eight and a half. But I did pick these up because um, wedges are the style for summer and these are super cute and they're very diverse. You can wear them with black, you can wear them with white, you can wear them pretty much with everything. And if I remember correctly, I think these were like $12.99, I wanna say. I haven't worn them. Um, I was going to wear them yesterday with an outfit, but I decided not to. Anyways, I did get these at Ross, and um, from everything else that I went shopping, I just really love how it ties around your ankle, and there's nothing in the back. I love that, and of course, I love all this bling, because that is totally me. Then um, I got these shoes, and this is funny, because these are only $17.99. And this says unlisted, but then if you look closely, it says by Kenneth Cole. Um, project, it says by Kenneth Cole production. And I got these shoes, they're, I love high heels, and this heel is probably only about maybe five inches or four and a half, so that's not that high for me. It's actually kind of a low heel, but I absolutely thought it was just super cute. <sighs> And let me see, I'm actually going to be wearing, I'm not sure which pair I'm going to wear because we're going to a party and I'm wearing this really cute silver jumper that I got at Charlotte Russe. So I'm not sure what shoes to wear. Um, that is how that looks. And it's, like I said, the heel is not really that high, 
but um yeah anyways so that's how they look on i totally love these anyways that's what i got well actually that, that's what my boyfriend bought me at dds he did buy me these heels because i needed some cute summer shoes and then he also did buy me these cute hello kitty pajamas i actually did get them at walmart when we went to get our keurig um, I did get them in a size large because I love my pajamas to be nice and loose and you can see that these are Really big on me, but they're super cute and super comfortable. So he got me these with the Keurig and Then from Amazon he ordered me my Hello Kitty beach towel and as you can see that's what it looks like it's her face and um, we like to go um, to the well, actually, this summer we really haven't been to a lot of beach places, but we have so much beach stuff that we really need to get out there. Um, anyways, so I finally got the beach towel. Then I was super excited when I found this online. If I can get it open. It is a makeup brush set by Hello Kitty, and it's a little tin. And it comes, <clears throat> comes with a lip brush, a face brush, a shader, eyeshadow, foundation, angled eyeliner, and eye shades stick. Now this is just too cute. Um, as you can see, this is, well, I would use this as a blending brush, maybe a foundation brush, but sorry about my phone. It's, I really need to get a new phone. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it does say, um, Hello Kitty, if it would focus. And then it is so cute because it's pink and white. So these little brushes came in this Hello Kitty makeup tin. And let me see, this looks like it's the blending brush. This one looks like it's the foundation brush. And of course, all of your little eyeshadow brushes. So that was my little Amazon surprise for the midweek from my boyfriend and then yesterday he took me to Bath and Body because um, there was some stuff that I wanted to get there so let me pull it out um, <clears throat> I love their soaps and this they, they were having a sale six for 24 I think it was six yeah I think we did the six for 24 so I got two kitchen lemons, which are the foaming, and in my opinion, the foaming hand soap seems to last a lot longer. It's 8.75 fluid ounces, so I got two of those for my kitchen. Um, I did get Beautiful Day, because it just looks so summery and just so cute, so cheerful. So I got Beautiful Day. Um, I let my boyfriend pick out one, so he got Eucalyptus Mint. And of course, vanilla coconut, because I absolutely love coconut. And then I kind of wanted to stick with my summer motif. I'm not big on the flavor watermelon, but this um, says, let's see, watermelon lemonade. So these are kind of like my two, these are my three summer scents. This is my boyfriend's scent, and this is for my kitchen. Then let's see. He did get um, another shower gel for men, and this is with Shea and vitamin E. This is eight fluid ounces. This was 75% off, and it smells so good. It smells very manly and eucalyptus-y. Um, and then, of course, they had their antibacterial. I think it was five for six dollars. So I picked out Sorry I'm Late. Because, of course, I love coffee. I thought that was super cute. Um, I picked out Magic in the Air. Because it kind of reminds me of that song by Bruno Mars. So, got that one. And then I let my boyfriend pick out one for himself. And this is Men's Collection Noir. And it smells really manly. So, you can put that in his truck. And Honolulu Sun. Because, again, it's summer. And that's just too cute. And then Be Fab every day so of course that's me um with the leopard print so I had to get that and that's what i got at bath and body and i'm looking for my for the receipt 
So let's see. Um, total was thirty-five dollars and sixty-nine cents. And let me see. Um, we did get, like I said, we did get the the soaps on sale. And um, oh wow, it looks like. Let's see. I'm trying to find how much we paid for the bath gel. Um, looks like it looks like we paid six sixty four for the bath gel. That's what my boyfriend is saying. So it was seventy five percent off. So still six 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 sixty four kind of seems like a lot. Well, anyways, this is what I got for thirty five dollars from Bath and Body. So Bath and Body. It can be kind of pricey, but um, I'm happy that I'm happy with what we purchased, and I'm happy with my little miniature uh, 99 cent haul. And if you can find these, I wish my camera was better because these are so super cute. I mean, they would make a cute gift or just to um, cheer someone up. Anyways, I've rambled long enough. Thank you everyone for watching. Please leave a comment or better yet, subscribe.